speak and I've read a lot about your work. Uh, we've never met formally. This is our first introduction and it's a pleasure to meet and work with you. And reading some of the content, uh, I, I understand that you actually have an asteroid named after you. Yes, I, uh, yes, there is an asteroid named uh, 2411 Hunch. And how did that come about? Uh, that came about because the, every every three years uh, our, our community has a, has a big uh, conference called Asteroid Comets and Meteors. And uh, I, I imagine uh, uh, that what happened is uh, your colleagues uh, feel that you have done uh, good work and they nominate you to a committee uh, to to um, for 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 this uh, sort of award, and then the the committee of this conference, uh, they, but it's actually a committee that is part of the International Astronomical Unit, uh, uh, Union uh, select a, a, a series of uh, bodies that that have been identified, but they have not been named yet and they named them after all the scientists that have been nominated. Uh, and I guess uh, last, last uh, year, in, in 2014, um, after the Comets and Meteors Conference, I, in the banquet, I found out uh, to my surprise that somebody had nominated uh, me. So that's um, for the work I have done with Raider. That is quite an honor. I'm sure you are very proud of that. Yeah, it was. It was a very. Uh, yeah, it was. Uh, uh, very, I was very touched. Yes, and uh, and it was a very proud moment. And it's uh, uh, very nice uh, to tell your family that uh, there is a rock orbiting the solar system that uh, carries the, the family name in a way, reaching a, a sort of mortality, immortality. I know where you're from. Uh, where is your hometown and uh, country from? So I'm originally from Buenos Aires, Argentina, where I studied physics. And when I was finishing my master, I knew I wanted to, to be a space scientist. But uh, this is, uh, I don't want to say how many years ago, but, you know, uh, many years ago. <laughs> and at that time, there, was, there wasn't that much space. Uh, science in Argentina, but uh, I managed to come across uh, uh, some people that were working on the first Argentine satellite in collaboration with NASA. And through that project, uh, that satellite was called sac -D. And through that uh, project, I, um, I met a, a group in Penn State who uh, then invited me to, to join them and, 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 and study for my doctorate, for my PhD. And this is, uh, this is already 20 years ago, and since then I've been here in the States uh, and finally joined NASA about five years ago. Well, and if you don't mind, sir, because we are uh, broadcasting...